YouTube, what's going on, man? Hey, we got to talk about trials. Max Mankey done changed a lot of things. So if you're new to the channel, hit that like button for me, subscribe, turn on notifications, and let's get stuck into the video. Last weekend, we saw the highest population of players playing trials ever. It was so much fun, I even made a video about it, which I've linked in the description below. Bungie flipped the script on us, they changed the matchmaking, and to be blunt, it just wasn't fun. The matchmaking after going flawless wasn't enjoyable. Bungie's main rationale for this change in matchmaking was to stop casuals and average players in PvP from getting stomped in trials. Some of my after flawless matches this weekend were up against absolute gods of the game. I even ran into Lima doing trials help on his stream. Now, I know you're going to get matches like that from time to time, but this was a consistent thing, running into stacked, sweaty-ass teams with hundreds of trials tickets between them, and here I am sitting with, you know, a measly 15 underneath my belt. I still got a lot done, though. I completed my Flawless Seal, I carried a new light to his first ever Flawless with the help of Twitch streamer Chaosy, and I went Flawless twice over the weekend, but it just wasn't fun. I didn't even play the whole weekend, and I think that was the, the feeling for the majority of the player base. They, you know, they just switched off, and it's, you know, mind-boggling for me to understand the decision-making when you have such a great opening weekend, and then straight out the gate just flip that around and change it to a point where it's not enjoyable. Now, you know, I understand experimentation, I understand trying to cater for the majority and the minority of player base to make sure the experience is, you know, accessible and fun for all, but this wasn't it. So I think Bungie need to go back to the drawing board around this, maybe implement this sort of lobby if you haven't reset your card after seven, but, you know, if I've reset my card on my account, then I shouldn't get this sort of you know consistent sweaty lobbies just because i've been flawless once over the weekend anyways guys that's all i wanted to get off my chest i uh, just wanted to give you guys my experience from the weekend and my thoughts on the matchmaking changes let me know how you guys went if you managed to get flawless what the games were like after going flawless let me know in the comments below we're going to end the video off with some of the highlights from the new light flawless carry that we did um, over the weekend i appreciate you all and i'll see you in the next video Don't use it, don't use it. Just slam him. Get the yep, you that. Free kill. Stay alive. Good shit. Now you can go slam this cunt. He's gonna gold here. Bam, baby. Let's go. You're fucking oh, idiot. Why is, that's what I mean. Like, golden guns there so you go, bad. Mate. If you're in a tight situation like that, you just don't have time to pop. You don't have time to get a shot off.